morning everybody oh my god like my skin looks so good i need to film this for you guys i'll probably have it on tiktok first though so follow me there but anyways i'm in hawaii i didn't do an intro last night we got here around somewhere in the afternoon but it literally took 12 hours of travel i don't know what happened i don't know why i thought i was gonna get from vancouver to hawaii in like three hours but that was not the case um there was 12 hours between me leaving my house and me getting to the hotel so i was exhausted but we did get some dinner i vlogged a few clips but now it's time for the intro so hello everybody we are in oahu hawaii and we are staying on waikiki beach you guys probably already know how much i love 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 coming to hawaii it is honestly the best place ever so i am super happy to be here we're actually here to celebrate my birthday this is my little birthday trip yeah so today is technically day one we are heading out the door to head to the kcc market which happens only on saturdays and we're a little bit in a rush because they do close at 11 and i think it's already like almost 10 but anyways i thought i would show you guys my outfit really quick this is my outfit so this is the bag that i am carrying it's my little vintage fendi that i got a while back and then this dress is from a brand called caramel monster i think they're based in singapore but it is so beautiful oh my god it's my first time trying it on this morning and i was in shock the material is so good the quality is absolutely amazing so really really loving this brand right now i have a few other of their dresses i'm going to wear during this trip and after trying on this one i'm beyond excited like the cut of it the neckline the shape the draping and the length everything about this dress is beautiful my new little Aramis slippers slippers were my little birthday gift for myself because i realized that i have no slippers to wear in hawaii and just in general i had no slippers but anyways we're rushing out the door so bye so we just got back to the car unfortunately when we were there trying to eat it got really rainy and windy and the wind actually blew our box with our sub in it onto the floor and then it ended up being unedible so we had to throw out half the sub that was really sad we're kind of mourning the loss still but it's fine because um we had a good little acai bowl and now we're moving on to eat my favorite poke in hawaii which is oh no seafood <laughs> about me I love ABC store I literally come to Hawaii and spend all of my time here like I come here every single day because I love it here and I always have one day where I do a big ass haul and I think today's the day that I'm doing my big ass haul One place 
apparently was not enough, so we are waiting on plate number two. And this time, we got extra butter, which is like the garlic butter sauce that they put on. That sauce is so scrumbly, I'm just yummy. So yeah, you come here and get the extra sauce. Also, if I remember correctly, this is like one of the best places to get Hawaiian coffees, cookies, chocolates, macadamia nuts to bring home, like all the souvenirs that they got you covered. This donkey is massive. Cheers, coconut latte. So we woke up today and I wanted to go to the Dole Plantation and stuff, but it's actually really windy and gloomy outside, which I'm a little bit gutted about because we're in Hawaii and it's never supposed to be like that, but it's fine. We don't care because we made a shopping day out of it. So I thought I would give you guys a little bit of a haul on the stuff that we got. Um, there's also stuff here from last night because we did stop by the ABC store last night. So yeah, this is like ABC store, a la Moana Mall, and I think that's it. So let me show you some of the stuff that we bought. Oh no, the third location is Don Quixote. Right, we literally just went there. Let's start with Don Quixote actually. So the first thing we got from there is this Ube Hopia, I don't know how to say that, Hi, And you guys probably remember from my last Hawaii vlog, but I have a literal obsession with Ube and they just so happen to have Ube stuff everywhere here. So that's amazing. I did get one pack of coffee. This is the Lion Coffee brand and I got the Vanilla macadamia flavor. I picked up three bags of macadamia nuts because I love macadamia nuts. So the first one is strawberries and cream white chocolate. Strawberries and cream white chocolate. This one is toasted coconut milk chocolate. And then this one is Kiawe smoked barbecue. So this is the only savory one that I bought today. Next up, I bought these Ardell lashes. They just look really pretty and I feel like I won't keep getting lash extensions when I return to Canada. So this is the Ardell Extension FX. This is what they look like. I just thought they looked really pretty in the store, so I picked them up. Another must try in Hawaii is their shortbread and I happen to love coffee flavored everything, so this is the flavor that I went with. So this is my Urban Outfitters bag. It also contains some stuff that I got from ABC store last night. So let's just go through everything. The first thing here is from ABC store. I don't even know what this is. So we got these little bracelets. I just thought they were so cute and pretty and tropical. Ooh, oh my God, I forgot about this. I got this cute bracelet. It's like a bangle bracelet. Kind of like a shell color with gold detailing on top and these blue flowers. I just thought it was really pretty. And then it kind of opens like this. You wear it like that. So pretty. We picked up a little keychain. So what we're trying to do is um, everywhere we go, we collect a keychain. And this is the one we picked up from Hawaii. It is so cute. Like, oh my God. When I saw this in the store, I kind of died a little bit. ABC store in Hawaii has the cutest, cutest Sanrio stuff. Oh yeah, I forgot I got this. Kona coffee macadamia nuts. So now I have literally like a lifetime supply of macadamia nuts, so that's really great. Birthday cake Kit Kat, because it's my birthday soon, so I figured that's an excuse to get this. And then I got the cutest little Hawaiian Manoa honey. How cute is this honey jar? Oh my gosh. And I'm someone who puts honey on literally everything. Like I put honey on everything, so. I could always use an extra bottle. Oh yeah, I got cuticle oil. Last time we came to Hawaii, my sister picked up one of these and we've been using it ever since. It's pretty good. So I picked up another one and it's just really pretty. I got a travel size toothpaste because we're running low of the other one. And my last thing of macadamia nuts. I actually didn't realize how much macadamia nut I bought, but this is the last one. It's the toffee flavor. And then from Urban Outfitters, I picked up these two. So this is kind of like a little combo. They're the same flavor. This one is a body oil and this one is a like a perfume or a body spray. And they're both in the Le de Coco flavor, which is coconut milk in French. 
and we tried them out in the store and they smelled pretty good and then i kind of just like the idea of having two products of the same smell so that you can layer the scent and it apparently is supposed to make it last longer and i also don't really have a lot of body oil so i thought this would be nice to have in hawaii so i can put on my skin and be like glowy and stuff so i ended up getting some makeup brushes from target because my current makeup brushes are so crusty and gross literally my boyfriend even commented that i should wash them um <laughs> but i saw that these sonia kasha brushes are on sale they're like half off and i thought they're so pretty like how pretty is this aquamarine blue and i also got a elf precision airbrush blender i'm hoping to use this for foundation or just like cream products in general yeah i also got this from target it's the goalie nutrition ashwagandha gummies i've been seeing people all over tiktok talk about ashwagandha and how it helps them with stress and anxiety and i realized recently when i was getting a massage the woman was like you feel like you are tense constantly and always stressed like is that true and i'm like wait i never was conscious about this but it's low-key true like i'm always anxious for no reason okay next up i stopped by sephora and got some things that are actually all mini size so the first thing that i got is this mini size of the sol de janeiro number 68 scent whenever i see a beauty product that is pink i low-key gravitate towards it because my makeup collection like my makeup and skincare collection is starting to have a pink theme to it and i think it is just so cute so yeah i've been collecting a lot of pink items and this one just caught my eye this also seems like it smells really nice i mean i know it's pretty popular i see a lot of people having it and it's in the brazilian jasmine and pink dragon fruit scent Ooh. Oh wow, like a really sweet florally scent. Mm. Next up, I am a January baby. You guys know my birthday's coming up, and I decided to go to Sephora and get my birthday gift. So I don't know why I always, always, always go for the makeup. I never go for the skincare or hair products. I always go for the makeup, and then I happen to get the wet lip oil gloss and air brow clear lifting treatment gel with lamination effect from Kosis. I think I already have this gloss, maybe not in this exact color, but I do carry this gloss in my bag all the time. Like it's literally always in my bag 24-7. It's my go-to lip gloss for touch-ups throughout the day. So I thought it would be nice to have a mini version of it. Let me just open it up so you guys can see. So this is the mini brow lamination. And then this is the mini gloss. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Next up, I got the small version of the color wow extra strength dream coat anti-frizz treatment and i've heard a lot of people raving about this product last from sephora i got this mini version of the huda beauty baby bake in the new color which is peachy pie the last thing from this haul i got these pair of shorts from brandy melville they're just like this really basic sweatpant material shorts and I thought it would be nice to have a pair of shorts to just throw on over my bikinis or just wear for a really casual outfit. And that wraps up this little haul. I'm now gonna go eat my pie. <laughs>
Okay, so Hawaii has decided to start acting up and it's been so windy and rainy lately. I feel like every single day in the afternoon there will kind of be like a stormy couple hours and that's happening right now. I don't know if you can see, but yeah. It's stormy outside, so we're just kind of taking shelter in our room, and I thought I would show you guys the flowers that I got from Matt, my manager, this morning. Woke up and like did some work, I filmed a TikTok, and I received this huge bouquet at my door, and I wasn't even expecting it, and I want to show you guys. So here she is, oh my gosh, this is honestly the biggest bouquet of flowers I have ever received, and it is absolutely beautiful like look at these flowers and are these orchids i think these are orchids but i mean because we're in hawaii so i feel like their floral arrangements are probably all so stunning because they have a good weather to grow beautiful stunning flowers like these but yeah i am so uh i'm just speechless at how beautiful this bouquet is so thank you so much to matt I literally did this hair with zero heat. Like I literally just took hair gel and scrunched my hair up and it's wavy. So I'm gonna start telling myself and everybody around me that I have naturally wavy hair. 